All right, finally made it over towards Quartermaster. I'm actually standing in the area that used to be next to the vet office and uh, the kennels for the canines for the MPs. Uh, we're looking directly over across what is now a self-service car wash and uh, into Sullivan Heights. And the buildings look kind of the same, but they are much different. Uh, the, um, the German contractors that uh, refurbished the units before they sold them to um, private industry actually dug out underneath them and they have park garages underneath each one of those buildings. Too bad the Army wouldn't have done that for us, huh? That would have been nice. Um, over here we have the old Burger King building. It's now a Pizza Hut KFC. And then they have a Lidl, L-I-D-L, which is a grocery store, uh, mini supermarket if you will, which is actually on the area behind right where the vet office used to be. And we're now in the parking lot area here. And then at the end of the building here, we have a quick pizzeria and then an Italian restaurant, which this is where uh, the main gate for and the railway station for Quartermaster Concern used to be. Um, uh, we can't really zoom in very well on that, but it's uh, Palladio is the name of the Italian restaurant. Great food, unbelievable. They even have a uh, small pond over there, which we'll go over to in just a few minutes, but uh, a little bit pricey, but then again, everything in Germany is pretty pricey. When they went from the Deutschmark to the Euro, all they did was remove the DM and put the Euro sign in there. So, you know, a four Deutschmark meal, which used to cost us two bucks, ended up costing us over six, uh, just by the, the change from the, the Deutschmark to the Euro. Don't really know what economists came up with that brilliant idea, but uh, maybe that's why they're hurting so bad these days. Um, then again, I guess we're all hurting. Uh, here's the old steam plant for Quartermaster, the one that actually provided the steam all the way through to, if I'm not mistaken, the very end of Centerville and all of Sullivan Heights. Because uh, if you remember, um, Cramerton had its own boiler and uh, I believe it was a dry cleaner or laundromat in the center of uh, Cramerton itself. So this is the old facility here for steam and all that, and it's been totally refurbished and it looks pretty good. And now I've done a complete 360 where we start.